And we're here, playing the punchy game. It's not supposed to be a punchy game. I just play it as a punchy game. I believe Mittens was my, uh... Yep. Hang on, shouldn't I just continue? I know I saved outside of Riften. Hey, Fire Rider. Ha, ah, see, I remember to update the Discord. That helped. But good to see you. Thanks for hanging out. After all that running and killing all those wolves, I still only made it to half level one. I, I don't even know. It's kind of sad. Am I still at Riften? I am still in Riften. Yay. This could get ugly, though. Sup? Okay. I don't got no tax. Oh yeah, I don't take shit. No. Ha ha ha. Wow, I, I, I persuaded you with speech level 15? You're kind of pathetic, man. You know, I don't want to take your advice. You just, you were just about to let your buddy just shake me down for money. Do I look like I have a lot of money? I'm a cat. Starting over is a perfectly legitimate way to play this game. Rift and discovered, yay. Mule. What's up with Mule? Yeah, just talk about Maven Blackbriar in public. You know, if you marry Mule, uh, Aaron will come live with you in your house. Well, see, Fire Rider, now it sounds like you, uh, you do know what you were doing. Rabble. I agree completely. I'm blatantly lying to you. Why do you trust me? Awesome. I should be cautious. Well, once you load it, you'll find out what you were doing. All right. You've probably heard me tell the story, Fire Rider, but my, uh, one of my favorite things was I married Mule, Aaron came with her, I had Lydia as a house Carl. I had a bard. So all that was going on in my house. I had too much equipment and didn't and I kept losing it in different chests, so I just started dumping it on the floor because I was a slob apparently. So when I dumped a pa a piece of armor on the floor, Aaron thought, "Hey, free armor." And picked it up and put it on. Lydia said, no, you don't steal from my, uh, Thane, or whatever they call me. And she attacked Aaron. And Mjol said, no, Aaron's my pet. And she attacked Lydia. So I had my house Carl and my wife fighting over this young man in the middle of my house, and the bard's playing music, and 
neither of them could die, and so they just would, like, beat each other up. And then, it, it was epic. I've always wanted to, to, uh, make that happen again. You don't seem nice. I think she needs to die. Can we kill her? Don't be mean to me, I'm a cat! I talked my way into this city. I can talk my way out of anything. Oh. Is that my only option? I can't, like, go backstab Sapphire? No, I don't generally run around killing everybody, actually. I'm just having a more chaotic playthrough since I'm a cat without any weapons. Hey, Sario. Wait, we already talked about this. Horses are your life. I got it. What time is it? It looks like... Wow, that's a lot of people wandering around this late. Let's go to the castle. I don't want to go to the castle. I know what I want. There we go. Miss Vale Keep. I'll bother you guys later. But for now... Ah! There we go. Nope, that's jump. I'll remember. There we go, finally. Here we go. I don't run around killing everybody, but I did come specifically here to murder one person because he has a piece of equipment that I want and that is how video games work. Ooh, axe. What's up, y'all? Man, no one is ever happy to see me. It's not going as well as I'd hoped. Health is low. Ah. I wonder if they'll chase me out of the rat way. I guess we'll find out. What items do I have? I got a butterfly wing. That'll help. Just chew on that. Salt. I'll just sit here and eat salt. It's crouching outside. Mmm, raw rabbit. All right. Okay. That's what I gotta do. I got this. I got this. Oh. That's not fair. Just waiting on me. I'm gonna die. This was such a good idea. Oh, hell. So my whole punch cat thing kinda, <laughs> kinda died real fast. Oh. 
Nah. Hey. It's going great. Maybe him I could beat to death. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. That was the best thing ever. I love crits. Oh, it's so good. Wow. Wow, that makes me so happy. All right, now I gotta figure out where this guy is. Where's the naked guy I killed? I am no good at... Can I drop down here? I can harvest the moss. Lucky me, okay. Came down here, killed the men, took their clothes. There's that. I guess I can drop down and then... That doesn't sound safe. Spell cat that also punches. Now see, why do people just leave... this lying around? Just very unsafe. There. I gotta slap something to death. Alright, where's that guy I want? Oh, jeez. That'll save me. Or I could just nap here. No one will bother me, right? Okay. Yes! Did I get him? That was anticlimactic as hell. Wow. Okay. I'll take it. No, I don't want to carry him. I just want to search him. There they are, gloves of the pugilist. And his rough spun tunic. Now I just have to figure out how to get out of here. Fireworks. A Skyrim story. Uh-oh. Things do not bode well for our level 1 heroes. I know I'm level 2 now, but that still is not a lot. Um... Well, our pugilist friend came from here. This door opens. Man, there's so much danger. What's up? You know, your mom shouldn't have named you Low Life. I'm gonna eat that cheese I found. I feel 1% better. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh, wait. Haha, <laughs> level up. Yes, increase health, please. All right. Next step on the punch cat. No, not two-handed. Heavy armor. Yep. Juggernaut. Urgh. I need 30 in heavy armor, which means I need to get some heavy armor. Because this guy beating on me with light armor, not doing much for me. 
No, I'm hiding. There we go. Am I not wearing anything? I mean, I know I'm not a naked cat, but... I'm wearing fur gauntlets. Duh. Gloves of the pugilist immediately. Imperial stuff. Nope, no heavy armor yet. It's weird because I'm never a heavy armor user, but it's kind of important. Ooh. Yay, pickpocket! Oh, good. I've accidentally found my way back. Thank you, naked people, for reminding me where to go. They're like my breadcrumbs. Will using a shield help? Maybe. I'm not that good with a shield. That's the problem. What time is it? Only 2 a.m., man. When I am enjoying the chaos of this game, I do like to see who's coded to where they can't die and who will die. Because sometimes it's fun just to beat the hell out of somebody and all they'll do is just... Leave me alone. I don't like you. My wealth is none of your business. See, this is one of those guys you can't kill. I've tried. I've tried to do the uh, bar fight thing. Or the murder thing. Or the assassin thing. Can't kill him. I don't want to help you. You're mean. Break the law? Are you kidding? Damn it! <laughs> I'm not your daughter. I'm a cat. Uh oh. What have I done? <sighs> okay. Okay. All of them? So really, I have no option. The, both is no. I just, okay. Excuse me, I'm having a conversation here. Thank you. It's a private conversation. <laughs> I have a coin. There. They're marrying people? Sure. What's up? Lizard with breasts. That it doesn't biologically. Oh, never mind. Oh, yes, show me to my room. I don't know. I never know which one. Who's talking to me? Aren't you fancy? I really have a lot of questions about the reptiles with the mammary glands, but it seems like a personal question. Thank you.
Biology has no place in Skyrim. You're right. You're absolutely right. Hey, Tish, how are you? As you can see, I'm being, uh, I'm being lazy today and actually playing a game instead of being productive. I was productive this morning, though. On your phone in the kitchen, cooking and listening. What's up, Talon J? Special drinks. Perfectly. <laughs> you know, when you have to tell somebody that your drinks are safe, that's not... Yeah. Perfectly safe, too. Uh-oh. Will not kill you. Not even a little. Exactly. <gasps> okay. Oh, wait. You want to give me a... You want to give me a quest, don't you? There's this guy in a yellow robe who can help you out. But you're not in Black Marsh. You can just go get an amulet of Mara from that guy. Do I look like I have three flawless amethysts? I'm a cat. Okay. Sup? You're just gonna trust some stranger? Oh, Frost. Yeah, I think I killed Frost in my last game. I can't find him. Man, people don't really... Honor deals in Riften. Sure, why not? Okay. Dude, your 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 problems are not a priority for me. You just you just put something on my list. Hey, Mule. What what? Oh, problem sapphire, right? You're you're Mule. You're sapphire. You're mean. It's third person pos. Yes, it is. These people are real pushovers. I'm, like, really low in speech. <laughs> I love Skyrim when it's like you have this is issue with somebody and it's resolved. And then they're just like, hey, buddy. Like, one, one, like there's a racist in uh, Windhelm. Who, you know, if you're just like, you know what? Elves are okay. He's like, let me fight you. And then he drunken battles you. And then you kick his ass. And then he's like, all right, you win. And then he's like your best friend afterwards. He's like, yeah, my buddy. Let's get some mead. And yeah. Oh, can't handle first person POV? I can try in third. It's, uh, I don't play it very often. But I did make a very pretty uh, cat, so might as well. Okay. Oh, just when you're playing. Okay. Yeah, you just gotta push down on the right joystick. And that uh, switches.
I have heard about Mara, thank you. Okay. Hey, Medesi. Okay. I just want to sell you my crap. Do I want to sell a silver ring? Yeah, I have some amethysts. And here's the cranky lady. You are delightful. Girl, will you be my friend? There, now I can sell all this crap. Boots, boots. Do not sell the gloves of the pugilist. I'm going to keep a shield just in case. I have some ragged boots and a rough spun tunic or two. I'm walking around in seven armor and I was carrying 23. Awesome. And 25. There. Now I'm naked, so I should probably put on my studded armor, but I need good uh, actual armor. I need heavy armor for once. Which I guess probably means I should kill somebody. Oh, I've got the key to Helgen Keep. Awesome. Because there's nothing to do there. Because it's all burned up. Okay, got to turn some wolf pelts into some leather. Brentholf is just lying his ass off. You're not... And then get yelled at by Grelka. It's a great sales line. Buy armor and live to tell about it. It is. It is a good sales line. I might see if Grelka will uh, sell me some heavy armor. I need to start working on that. Oh, there's no dragons. Trust me. This guy's got a chip on his shoulder larger than an Elder Scroll. I mean, I... He's just whiny. Dude, chill. I'm new here. Yes, you sound like really a brave person. Dude, you are dressed in finery, and there's cheese on the table. I think you're fine. Okay. Yes, explain to me.
I'm a cat. I don't understand. <laughs> I appreciate her honesty. Okay. Yes. I'm, I don't know if we're having the same conversation. There we go. I don't know. Seven? <laughs> I wish you could make her a companion. Yep. She needs a rubber duck. She does. She really does. Told you. I know how to cast flames. Exactly. Yep. Totally. Thermic drift. Mama used to tell me about thermic drift. <laughs> oh, she's delightful. She needs, a, she needs a rubber duck. I need to go find her a rubber duck. Everybody's kind of looking at me. I'm feeling a little comfortable here. You know, I could be the Dragonborn, or I could just open up my own courier business in Skyrim. Mm-hmm. You do know that Orichalcum and Soul Gems are found everywhere. You don't specifically need yours. Experiment. Okay, point the way. Sure. Not really. I just wanted to, you know... Here, have a book about a beggar. Uh... I think, uh, considering how well I'm doing, healing might be a good idea. How much monies do I have? Not a lot. Uh. Oak flesh might be good. Yeah, okay. Social distancing. The way of life, dude. Don't worry. I'm glad I took off my Imperial uh, armor before I came in here. Okay. Good. Sounds good. Maven Blackbriar. No. No, I'm talking to the lady behind you. Excuse me. Everyone's so happy to see me. You're just going to say that out loud? So what happens if I take over the Dark Brotherhood? Can I kill her? Yeah, I haven't decided what I'm doing about the uh, horse yet. There are a lot of wolves and spiders on the road, lady. You need to work on that.
Well, we like rain. Rain makes the crops. What's what's the problem with clouds? I don't understand. Mm-hmm. Oh, surely. I'm a cat. But there's like 17 other gods you can worship. Why Talos? Did they ever just explain that? Why you can't worship Talos? Because there are a lot worse gods out there to pray to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, King Ray 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 is raiding with a party of six. Welcome, raiders. Thank you. Good to see you. Uh, my name is Murr. I am playing Skyrim, and I'm trying to be unarmed with a cat. Although, wait, I need... That she's got an enchanting table, doesn't she? Except I don't have any gems. Ooh, yeah, okay. I need to keep the gloves of the pugilist as they are. But yes, welcome. I am a variety streamer. I usually do podcasting, but on Wednesday... Dude, I'm just walking by, just passing through. But yes, on Wednesdays I do play uh, games. Variety. Heavily modded Skyrim yourself. What did you mod? I'm currently playing on Switch, so uh, I'm not sure if they're that's moddable. But I actually did buy Skyrim for the Xbox specifically because of all the mods. Because uh, there weren't any for the PC. Or, no. For the PS4. Too many to name, okay. <laughs> I'm Dagger. Okay. Finally. I'm actually relieved that I couldn't pass a persuade check with somebody because it, I'm too low a level f to be persuading anybody to do anything. In my other game, any time I leave Riften, a dragon attacks. It's like there's just, there's like a dragon hive somewhere, and they're like bees. Now, I could get into Riften. What, what's y'all's problem? I'm one of you. Why would I judge you? I got in. That reminds me, do you have any skooma? Moon sugar. Now see, I could just buy what's-her-face an ingot, but that's not the way it works. It has to be her special ingot. 
Do you have any heavy armor? You do! I can't afford that. Wow. Okay. Oh, those are iron boots of lifting. I'll buy a helmet. That's all I can afford. You don't want my arrows. Yeah, I'm not worried about Magicka right now. I wonder if I can... Can I use Frostbite Venom on my claws? Hmm. Oh, right. I need to, I need to learn that. Okay. Thank you, nice lady. Okay, so we've learned that I really can't attack people who are in, like, heavy armor and a shield. At least not yet. So I gotta remember that. Because that was scary. I, did, I was not doing anything to that guy. Until I set him on fire. Which makes me feel like I was cheating, but you know, I'm gonna have to figure out a way to bring dragons down too. And you can't do that by punching them. On my way here, I could not get away from wolves. Now I just want to, like, test out my oak flesh and my new gauntlets. And Oh, and I should probably put my helmet on. I bought it. There we go. Now I'm a force to be reckoned with. Sup? You don't look friendly. Okay. Don't think I can take on a whole big old bandit camp. Skyrim's so pretty, though. I mean, God, how old is this game? Like, ten years? And it's still pretty? Did it come out in 11? I can't remember. Now I'm just exploring. Horse! Uh-oh. Horse just standing there. It's a bad sign. Oh, Wait, you're abandoned. I don't care. Loot. Loot, loot, loot. Now see, this is what I don't get. You can loot all sorts of stuff from people. But if you get a horse, and then you get off the horse, it wanders away. Yes, you're right, Fire Rider. That's going to be amazing. Okay, so I was almost right. Wow, 10 years. There's all sorts of stuff going on here. I missed a lot of excitement. I see, I'm going to get off this and the horse is going to be like, yep, I'm going to go back to where I was. No, it, oh, excuse me. So if I could just grab it. Oh, there were three. Oh, well, I don't care. Oh, I'm going to use the horse. It's just going to wander away when I get off of it. Which is sad, but, you know. At least I got a horse now. I wonder what killed that bandit. Ah. I gotta say that some of the um, sound effects are a little alarming. Like, you found a cave noise is terrifying. It's a very, like, scary noise. Uh-oh, uh-oh, get out of there. Okay. 
But it's just like, you found a cave. It's okay. Get back here. No. Sorry, check, catching up with chat. I got mine for PlayStation in 2011, need it for my Switch. Yeah, it's it's fun on the Switch. And just the fact that you can say you're carrying Skyrim around in your pocket is just, there's just something mind-blowing about that. It's awesome. It's a very, um... We live in the future, can you believe it kind of thing. And when you discover something while sneaking, it's a fucking heart attack. I don't think I've experienced that. Did I just run over a fox? Oh, a bunny. Okay. But it's okay. Uh-oh. What? Is that a skeever? It is a skeever. I'm not getting off my horse for a skeever. I just got this horse. Snuck around a lot. I see. I should probably be doing that, but I found a horse, so, you know, priorities. Now this is where, games like this, I love so much, but they're so bad for people like me who have no sense of direction. There's an awful lot of, oh good, I found it. Uh-oh. Okay, the horse is okay. What's up, guys? No one seems happy to see me. And I'm like, friendly and stuff. That's not nice. Man. These people are just rude. Of course, I'm wearing looted armor and riding a stolen horse, so I guess I can't judge too much, but... But my looting is noble. Sounds like someone wants claw punches. Yes. Uh-oh. Okay. Damn it. There. Uh-oh. Got a leg of goat to eat. Okay. Come back. Come back. Oh no. Come back, horse. Wait. Ugh. Okay. I don't even know where I'm going. I just like to discover things. And then the best feeling is when somebody sends you on a uh, quest and you realize it's to a place you just discovered by chance. And so you don't have to worry about where to find it because it's already there. Wait, there was a dwarven thing up here. How do I get up there? Oh. Yeah, I really am a straight... straight line to a place kind of person. And it's... Oh, there's almost nothing in Skyrim that fits that. Or any game, really. Mazolft. I seem to remember this one's important. Alright, I'm bored. No! Didn't mean to do that. Okay. I'm bored wandering around the rift. Uh, what do they want me to do? They want me to talk to the Jarl. But yes, I highly recommend Skyrim for the Switch. It's lots of fun. And you know, it looks really good. So... I don't know if they have some of my favorite bugs. They do have some interesting bugs. But uh, my favorite bug was the marriage bug with one of the characters where 
If you don't talk to him right after you get married, he will run away. And then you can tell him, hey, let's move to my home in Riften. And he'll be like, great, I'll meet you there. And then, that does not look good. I'm, I'm level two, I'll totally help. Ha ha! Uh oh. Damn it. Oh well. I tried. I tried to help them with the dragon, and now they hate me. And that's Farkas. He's a named guy, isn't he? Damn it. Last time I helped somebody. Excuse me. Pardon me. Oh, that's right. You can make your horse go faster. For like a second. There we go. Okay. I did not mean to punch him in the head. I was trying to punch the giant. I was helping. They're all wearing the same clothes. It's all, all the human oh, humans look alike. Hey guys, what's up? Hey, you're my people. What's up? Yeah, I'm here too. Okay. Ooh, can you train me to sneak? Ha ha! But you're gonna charge me money, aren't you? Hmm. Alright, that's all I can afford. Thank you, lady. It's kind of strange how they don't, like, acknowledge that you're the same people. Uh-oh. It's my friends. Yeah. That's what I was worried about. I'm not sure if they're ever going to forgive me. I can see them getting mad at me. Yeah, too bad there's not a sorry button. I mean, I stopped using um, area of effect. Uh, sorry, area of effect spells uh, uh, from scrolls. Because I kept hitting my um, my companion with whatever I was casting, and then they would get mad at me and try to kill me. Hey, look out for my persuade. Yeah, don't talk to Farkas about me, okay? Bye, horse. I really do need- Farkas sounds like a very familiar name. I know he's a white run, big white run person. Ooh, my electric kettle has arrived. Life is so exciting in pandemic times. My electric kettle died. So, I had to buy a new electric kettle and it just arrived. I'm going to look up Farkas. Okay. That's right, he's with the companions. What's up, Adrian? I will smith you an iron dagger. Yeah, the, uh, yeah, Farkas is the blacksmith at the Companions, also a werewolf. So if I go into the Companions, I don't know if he's going to want to see me. Oh, nope.
Did she just give me a backhanded compliment? You're the one on the grindstone. You sharpen it up. I can't. There. Thank you. If only sharpening my kitchen knives were that easy. No. I've crafted leather. You know, you just keep telling me to use every tool that you're currently using. So I really can't. There. Tan some leather. Check out my leather. I know, Adrian. Hmm. Sorry. Hide helmet. I don't want to hide helmet. You totally could. You know, I've got a destiny, but I'd much rather just like carry messages and smith for a living. Sure. No. Are you the power behind the power behind the throne? Actually, she's pretty nice. A lot of people are just like rude for stupid reasons when it comes to uh well anything really oh wait i can sell you crap i can improve crap and then sell you crap there we go and increase my smithing yay oh okay hop up boop Four monies. Four more monies. I love how this, this game specifically has the ability to get sick and possibly get very, very sick, like become a vampire. But separate from that, there's also the ability to just have your companions just start coughing. Which, just like right now in pandemic times, is a little scary. Like, why are you coughing? I'm just... I need to know. Are you a vampire? Are you are you infected with werewolfitis? Werewolfitis. I don't think that's what they call it. Lycanthropy. Dude, all I need is what's growing out of my hands. Wait, can I improve the battle axe? Yo, 
You're welcome. I'm wondering how long Farkas is going to have that, um, that grudge. It's going to be like better off dead with the kid, the paper boy. And I'm going to walk into a city and he's going to start coming running up to me with his two-handed sword, screaming two dollars. Hey, I got a shield bat a shield battle axe right now that's fine. It says so. So All right. Banded iron armor. Now we're talking. I can't afford that. I have 89 monies. How did I did I just spend more on iron? Yeah, that's the problem. You spend on iron to improve your ability to improve your weapons, but the improvement on the weapons doesn't equal the the price raising the, the the cost you get in raising the weapons is not more than the cost of the iron to improve the weapons. So I guess you could say you get the the experience, which is a, which is good. Experience is good, but still. Well, la di da. All the children in Skyrim who are homeless or sad or hungry makes me sad. No, don't ask her. It breaks your heart. No. Actually, I adopted her in my other game, so I know she's okay. I adopted her and the little girl selling flowers in Windhelm. And then, uh, you know, then I come across other kids who are homeless or orphaned, and then I can't help them, and it makes me sad. Especially since I have houses freaking everywhere in the other game. I am just like a real estate maven. And I can have kids in every house. Because I'm sure that's what my house carls sign up for when they agree to serve me. Yeah, you can't shove all the homeless children in all the houses. Yeah. Alvor sent me. Put your sword away. Dragon. I was there. What do you think I'm doing here? Don't act like this is your idea. With my own eyes. <laughs> Great view. All the Imperials were trying to cut on my head. That's not what I would say. Dragon. Fire. There. Oh, right, that's Adrienne's dad. Yeah. Dragons don't really lurk. Can I go? Will someone save me from Farkas if I go outside? Yeah. Nobody likes you, Preventus. I went to Ripton to kill some people first, but yeah. Aw, 
awesome. Of course there is. You don't even know what my talents are. Dragons and rumors of dragons. Those are two different things. You know, I gotta say again that Adrienne is pretty nice because she's like, Hey, nice to see you. I make swords. I advise my father. Hey, you could make a great smith. And everybody else is just like super rude right when you meet them. See? Fine. Can you say laboratory like Dexter? Where is, oh, he was hiding behind the... I'm like, where is he? Yeah, fill me in. Jarl said so. More fetching. Okay. Or I've played this several times. Yeah, it's not going to be in a hallway or something. Simplicity itself. A lie. Oh, so they won't mind if I just loot their dead? Okay. Ah, so you are forthcoming about your criminal past too, aren't you? D does it look like I'm still talking to you? No, I want to keep him right now. I'm not anywhere near ready to start enchanting. I have no heavy armor skill simply because I don't have any heavy armor yet. <sighs> I think I should probably beef up my alteration to help my uh, stone flesh and everything. I know it says no backstating, but uh, considering my main focus is going to be heavy armor so I can beef up that gauntlet, that unarmed skill, I'm not sure what else to do. Speech? Speech, lockpicking, pickpocket, sneak. Those are good for the cat. I'll just keep up with the speech. Why not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you will. All I want is Lydia. One of my favorite uh, Skyrim videos is Lydia No, where a guy told Lydia that he was done with her and she's like, okay, I'll just walk back to Whiterun. And she starts walking directly across a giant's uh, area. And <laughs> the guy starts yelling, Lydia, no! And the giant, the giant just walks up to her and hits her with his... Uh, Hits her with his club and knocks her straight up into the air. And if you've ever felt a giant do that, then, you know, it's pretty much death. You fly way, way up in the air and then you fall way, way down. But if you, uh, 
but Lydia is, is, you know, you can't hurt her. So you, Lydia goes way up in the air and then she falls down and the guy's yelling, Lydia, no. And then Lydia just gets back up and keeps walking. <laughs> Are those white run guys coming? Or are they just whining about having to go? Should I go say hi to the companions? Is Farkas still waiting for me? I'm saying a lot of words. Have you seen Farkas? No, I want to know if you've seen Farkas. I have met Maven. Oh, thank you! T-E-S-V Skyrim Lydia the Unbreakable. Very cool. Yep. Oh, I'm gonna follow this guy. Maybe he'll protect me from Farkas. Are they sending this one guy? Just this one white run guy to Riften. Or not Riften, uh, Riverwood. This is gonna. Okay. I bet he wants a horse too. Is he going there? Am I just follow like No, he's he's on his way, yeah. Yep, that's where he's going. One guy. Nope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm afraid. So this guy's pathfinding isn't the best, but... It looks like he's going to Riverwood all alone to fight the dragon. I have faith in you, solo guardsman. I got your back. I know I could fast travel, but I just really want to see what this guy's doing. Okay, got tired. Time to... Now somebody else is running. But it's just white run go... Dude! White... I have like 89 gold. Ow. That's rude. Also, something stupid to say when you've got, like, just a handful of, uh, health points. Fuck you! Where were you when I was getting my ass kicked? That was rude of me. No, it wasn't. It was justified. Yeah, I know it was the Imperials who want to cut off my head, but if you're not playing a Nord or a human, it's like you lose, lose uh, patience and sympathy for the Stormcloaks real fast in this game. So I did nothing here. I didn't like learn how to smith from the guy. I didn't take all the free stuff they offered me. I didn't help out with the missing stuff. I just ran through. Oh, they're still running. Where are they going? Okay. 
Ah, they're here for the chicken. And now they're walking home. Okay. Good job, guys. Okay. Do you also break the sawmill? Wink, wink. Oh, I see. So if Adrienne teaches me how to smith... I don't have the raw materials. I also don't have any money. I need to start working on my uh, pickpocketing. Oh, I can make iron armor. Sweet. Can I make... What, what goes into banded iron armor? Corundum. I don't have that. Okay. I'm wondering if my uh, sneak plan plus iron armor plan <laughs> is going to work well together. I still need our iron boots. Why do I keep jumping? Yeah. See, they don't like elves either. Well, he's got corundum. Dang it. I need to figure out how much of everything I need before I just go shopping. All right, I'm not going to go for the banded stuff right now. I like to match. All right, three iron. And two iron. So five and seven to improve them. Eight for the stuff I just did. Okay, do I have that much money? No. Is there anything I can sell? Steel dagger? Yes. That's right, that's what that, uh, what are they called? The lizard people. Argonians. That's what the Argonian had on him. Okay. Dang it. Did I just... Oh, right. That should be everything I need. There we go. Yes. Ah, I got daggers, man. They grow out of my hands. I don't know why I said that like it was high. I have no weapons. Right, that's what I need to do. I need to take off the armor I'm wearing, put on the new armor, sell him the old armor. Except for the gloves of the pugilist. Okay. 
I'm going to be very careful here not to sell the gloves of the pugilist. Okay. There. Now, where can I... Can I enchant anything in this town? I don't know if I can. Oh, that's right. This argument. You're not my dad! I want the cheese. I really want the cheese. If I crouch, can I take the cheese? No. I want the cheese. I should save, save, <laughs> I should save every time before I sell stuff. Do you have a new chanting thing? Gosh, you're shocked that they broke into your store to steal your solid gold thing? Or I could just keep the claw. Hey, I'm supposed to go there anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Grumpy, grumpy, grumpy. I need... Ooh, can't afford that. Now here's the problem. Is that you have, um, if you want to learn enchanting, you need to fill soul gems. And to fill soul gems, you either have to cast the soul siphon spell or, my favorite, enchant a weapon to just capture an animal's soul if, you, if it dies within a couple of seconds. But I don't have a weapon now. So. That's, that's a building, dear. Are you going to take me there, or? Okay. Oh, good. Are you take, okay, you're not going to take me anywhere, are you? Or find a weapon that already does that. Yeah, but I'm trying not to use weapons. I always felt a bit slimy with this whole chimp thing. Yeah, it, it does feel bad. Although I do get a little... At one point, I, I, I have gone as dark as to kill a human, trap their soul in a soul gem, and use the soul to enchant a weapon, and then name the weapon after the person. I did have a Lydia sword for a little while. There's a bug in um, the sorry the Switch version. There's a bug in the Switch version where uh, I don't know what I tr did to trigger it, but the um, wagon won't take me anywhere. It's like you you pay the money and then you get in the back of the wagon and it doesn't go anywhere, and um, I even bought a wagon for my house to see if that would fix it. But no, all it did was make the guy start saying, I don't have all day. Get in the back if you want to go anywhere. And I, you know, I get in the back and nothing happened. So I finally tried to kill him just because he was really annoying me. And I didn't get his soul. So I, I was going to ma name a weapon after him. Yeah, I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings in this game, but I will um, kill them and take their souls and name weapons after them. 
I'm not lost. I know where I am. Oh, how scary. Ah, what's happening? Ah. Yeah. I'm liking the punch cat thing. I'm liking it a lot. Oh, money. I know it's for game balance purposes, but I really hate the fact that pickaxes and woodcutter's axes are so heavy. I mean, they're ridiculously heavy. Ooh, nice. Yeah, it doesn't look like I got anything good. And I'll just leave these bodies here. I've been going the right way. I bet I'm not. I could check the map, or I could go discover this giant camp. Giants won't hurt me. No, oh, no, I am going the right way. I guess the giant camp is down the hill. Yeah. Yes, Lydia can survive them. But I don't have Lydia yet. I gotta... I guess I gotta get that dragon, um... The, the dragon rock thing that's in here. Okay. Cool. Oh, hey. What about a young woman's purse? Any more terrible people around? Someone's shooting at me. There they are. Okay. Yes, Lydia can survive them, so I should too. In indeed. That's very, very true. No, I'm just picking up skeevers. <laughs> I don't know, just something about it just amuses me. Ah, I keep hitting the wrong button. Sorry, guys. Yes. Yes, it is. Aww. Oh. Over encumbered already? I just got here. 
Story of my life, man. Okay. Oh, I'm not even wearing the gloves of the pugilist because my plan was to unenchant it and then I got distracted. One healing and some bread. I'll be fine. Wait, I need that. Why am I carrying two shovels? I was carrying eight pounds worth of shovels. Oh no, webs. We know what webs mean. We don't like what webs mean. Does that go anywhere? No. Ah. Playing this is always stressful because of the undead noises down here. And considering I usually play in the living room with the the, the television and not with headphones on, it's it is a new sensation having the creepy noises in my ears. Uh oh. Oh, I see. That was a... <laughs> that was one of those warning things, wasn't it? Okay. Ah, got it. Snake, snake, fish. Is there anything up here? Yes! Haha! -ha. That is some healing if I do. If I'm not mistaken. Hooray! Okay. Now, loot the poor bandit outlaw. That's how it's done, man. See, there's that, that, that dire discovery sound again. Boom. Yay. That doesn't sound good. Excuse me. Beavers. Okay. 
Dragger scared the crap out of me when I first started playing. Yeah, there's something about that evil coughing sound that just... Not what you want to hear. More webs. What is it about Skyrim and all this shit you can pick up? It just seems like, why would I want the linen wraps? Why are you letting me loot the linen wraps? Oh, this guy. And you have to free him, don't you? Ah, shit. I'm not here to save you. Punch spider. Punch the spider. Punch it. Punch it. And now I'm poisoned. Punch the spider. Yeah. I punched a spider. <laughs> Thank you, Fire Rider. Ew. Why did I just loot that? Just. Maybe this time he won't be a jerk. Kick that spider. No. What? Honey, this is not going to end well for you. Yeah, I'll just let you, you deal with those. We'll just watch this, see how it plays out. Okay. That's right. Oh, Rail, you're a dick. Also, you're welcome. Don't step on the thing. Dang it! Kill it! Kill it! Kill it! Jeez. I can like one shot kill bandits with one hit and then zombies. I'm just like, eh. Now how did I wake that up if I was hidden? Guess I'm not sneaky anymore. I don't think I ever got that high in sneak, Fire Rider. Okay, I can't I can't aim apparently. Okay, this is not well, let's level up, why not? Stamina helps your stuff you can carry, right? Yeah. 
Oh, I was a stereotypical sneaky bow person too. I just didn't really put a lot of points into sneak, so I didn't increase those abilities. All right, now what are we doing? We are killing thing. Okay, that's better. That went great. I'm just looking forward to my shouts. Oh. This one's like a sneaky one. Except I burned myself. Wasn't that smart. up yeah I'm looking forward to uh, getting the uh oh I'm looking forward to enchanting that uh, that armor wait I didn't put that on again did I <laughs> okay, got that going, got that going. I don't think I needed that, but whatever. There, that'll show them. Oh man, I just increased my stamina. crud. Oh well. It's not like these weapons get you much money. Just when you have almost no money, it actually matters. Okay, definitely don't need those, even though they're not heavy. There. Come on, aren't we at the end yet? I love being the stereotypical sneaky bow person, actually. I just end up, you know, I've got that thing of playing uh, games over and over again, so you try to do something to make it different. So, I don't know how that detected me. But, so now, you know, doing the unarmed cat thing. Last time I, my other game, I'm trying to be more of a mage, but I ended up, because you have that typical mage problem of sucking really, really badly at low levels, I eventually just picked up the bow just to keep myself alive. And now I am bow mage person. But I did accidentally kill one of my own uh, people at the college, and then... Uh, tough deer took away my uh, archmage title, which I didn't think he could do because I was the archmage. But whatever. Um, I also think I got um, the Khajiit mage killed, but I'm not sure because usually when you get someone killed, they even if you're responsible for it, they get, uh, you like inherit their stuff or something. But with the, in this case, I didn't get a note that he was dead, but he's not at the college and he's, he's not anywhere else. So I'm assuming he died during a battle and I must've hit him to make it worse. But I felt bad. I like Jazargo. There's something worthwhile down here, isn't there? There better be. Alright, 
Give me treasure. I got a skeever. There's treasure. A chest I have to unlock. Did I take it? No. Hmm. There we go. Hide boots. Came all the way down for hide boots. And a skeever tail. And a little bit of gold. But mostly hide boots. That's right. My plan was to get a soul gem, enchant the gauntlets, and then start with the enchanting stuff. I remember now. Then I could sell all the enchanted stuff and make some fat monies. Because I won't be needing them myself. Who's coughing at me? Oh, hey. Yes, increase my heavy armor. Increase it. Damn it. Uh oh. Okay. That was scary. That's right. I should have gotten that heal spell. Do I have the heal spell? Maybe I have the heal spell. I'll check. Realize I didn't even check. Yes. Silly person. That would have been good to know. Okay. I heard of somebody playing Skyrim and uh, trying to do a complete, what was it? Illusion run? Like only use illusion magic, which seems excessive to me. I think a lot of it has to do with um, convincing your companions and area animals to do your fighting for you. Courage and fury and all that. Man, I don't have whirlwind sprint. Da da da. Ha ha! Look at me be clever. I'm gonna get my butt kicked. Well, that went well. Ouch. Hey, go down the steps. Amulet of Arche increases health. Yes, please. Hmm. my horse is. Well, not my horse. Somebody's horse. wonder where that horse is. I wonder if I could find that same... If it just went to go wander and stand by that bandit uh, corpse. I could find it, like, north of Riften or something. What well, sounds incredibly hard, the uh, illusionist run. Do you know if it was the same one? Could you find the bandit again? I, it's, I think I remember where I found them. Um, but I mean, if the horse is just hanging out there, standing next to a dead naked body, then yeah, I would assume. 
Huh. Uh oh, I did not realize I picked that up. Uh oh, hide. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's right. I picked it up because I, I, the, 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 there was the thief. Okay. Uh, how do we do this? I remember. A bear, moth, and owl, or something. Close enough. There we go. I mean, considering that there aren't just horses just sitting around in Skyrim, I would think it would be somewhat easy to find. Relatively. Creepy, skittery noises. I wonder if I could backstab with a punch. This seems safe. Now see, there's bats around. I could get rabies, which I think I'm already sick. Aren't I? No. Hmm. I am sick. I have rock joint. Oh, that's, that's 40 pounds overweight. Uh. There we go. awesome. What do I want to drop? Probably a great sword. And a bow. There we go. I'm not normally a melee person, but I gotta say this, uh, this walk up to boss droggers and punch him is very satisfying. Very, very satisfying. Good way to de-stress, indeed. Where am I? Definitely don't have a horse here. I gotta remember to come back here and get all the other crap that I stole. I 
Going the right way. Nah, we'll just fast travel. Ah, trolls. So much fun. Hmm. No, I'm not gonna. Mm -hmm. Okay. What's up, Alver? Nah. I just realized it's six o'clock. I should probably be heading downstairs for food soon. But we do need to give the people back their thing. Here's your thing. Can you do me a favor and stop bussing your sister around? You're not her dad. Yeah, just leave it right there on the counter. That'll keep it safe. Yeah, I don't care what you have to sell. I should probably try to either improve or... Uh... Un disenchant stuff. Oh wait, I'm supposed to improve them. I just said. Ooh, true shot. I don't need that. Scrolls are just dangerous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fascinating. Your chat is only showing up on the screen and not in my actual stream chat, so that's weird. Um, so I'm sorry I haven't been responding to you because I didn't see you were here. I don't know what's going on there. That's really strange, but um, I just noticed that I saw your name on the stream chat and not here in my chat where I can actually read it well. Uh, so, sorry about that. I don't think I can. I haven't tried to poison my fist yet, honestly. I, I'm i not carrying anything. Requires iron and leather. But I can try it. Dang. Alright, so... Hey, Sven. Hmm. Guess I'll just wait. Oh, you're from YouTube! Ah, got it, got it, got it. Thank you. People almost never watch on YouTube, so I didn't see it. Although, the multi-stream isn't showing anything either. The multi-stream chat is not 
Refresh chat. That's weird. I'm very sorry. I don't know what's going on. Yes, I'm mostly Twitch, but the uh, I do I do have multi-stream chat available. Okay, I don't know. Sorry, I'm. There he is. This is annoying. Okay. Okay, an iron ingot is 19. Do some math here. Uh, okay. Oh, there it is. Ha ha, finally. Okay, I got it, Aaron. I can see you. There's the chat. I can read it. We're good. Sorry about that. Yes, the chicken. Chickens are uh, chickens are dangerous. If you accidentally hit one in town, you're just like everybody wants to kick your ass. Okay, right. I'm looking to see. Okay, ancient Nord sword. It's five dollars if I sell it now. And I take the nineteen dollar. I can't even steal. I need steel to improve it. I'm not I'm not wasting a steel ingot on this. This is ridiculous. All right. Then let's check the dagger. Dagger will get me four dollars. I'm starting to see the that this is pointless. A very much it uh money loss effort. No, I don't fight giants. I get in trouble when I fight giants. So now I have an improved dagger that's still four dollars. Well, alrighty. That was a big waste of money. I'm kind of disgusted. The economy in Skyrim's just broken. That's all there is to it. I'm going back up to Bleak Falls Bear to get my crap. I'm going to come down and sell it. And then I'll probably... Close it up. I gotta go all the- I can't fast travel to the door? What's this world coming to? I just wrote a scene this morning about people refusing to leave dead bodies floating out in space and here I am killing people in the snow and just leaving them naked. Now I'm pretty sure I'm going to end up buying Skyrim on the Switch. Uh, good game for when Hades is too technically challenging for me. Yeah. It, I, I'm sorry to be a bad influence, but it is, it is really good. Alright, how much are we carrying? Sixty pounds too much? Good lord. Oh, the Dragonstone weighs 25? Wow. Wow. All right. Whatever. Yeah. 
Yeah, I, I have it on three platforms. I'm not proud, but that's the truth. I, I have it on three platforms, so... Yeah. Maybe I'll come back and get it later if I find myself really tapped for cash. Or if I get a horse. Or if I get Whirlwind Sprint. But yeah, it's like I said, I find it really fun just trying to think of something different to do. Because there's so much to do in the game. Even though the plot is the same, there's different paths to take. There's different people to support. Um, you know, do you support the Dark Brotherhood? Do you clean out the Dark Brotherhood? Do you join the Companions? Do you go become a werewolf? Do you become a um, uh, vampire? Hey, thanks for pledging via Patreon, Scry. Appreciate it. Hope you enjoy the uh, all the perks like the Discord and uh, archives and early episodes and stuff. I'm finally caught up on my episodes. Tomorrow doing another episode I should be writing and then hopefully we'll get that out to people soon and then by next week I may be on a regular posting schedule because I really don't like doing the like four episodes every two or three weeks because my Twitch streaming is regular but my production and posting for the podcast are not and I'm not proud of that so uh yeah I was a werewolf already but they offered to change me and I couldn't decide <laughs> wait I thought they're just trying to decide if I changed to vampire so long it defaulted to no I didn't know that was a thing because I I did that and what that amounted to was forgetting to get healed and then I just became a vampire. And then, like, my friend ran away from me and I felt sad. Yeah, I think my husband went the companion werewolf route. Dairy the pop of vamp for like 30 or 45 minutes. No joke. <laughs> oh, wow, Aaron. That was a long time ago. Yeah, uh, I got some books published uh, via traditional publishing. I wrote a Star Wars book. I wrote a Minecraft book. Um, and I started streaming last summer. So... That's what I've been up to creatively. Still doing the writing podcast, just streaming them live and then putting them out on the uh, feed. All right. Wow, I have money now. That's exciting. All right. Get rid of this damn heavy stone and then I'll be done. Agonizing over the change. Yeah, it's tough. It is that those are big decisions, especially since it's like the vampires, you're so powerful and everybody's terrified of you. <laughs> so there's a downside. Not very good um, companion experience. They don't like you very much. I know, honey. I know you want some mead. Get, let me in the door. I want to go in the door. Can I go in the door? There we go.
This is funny. I have a friend who streams, and he streams, his audience is on YouTube, and he streams to Twitch, and I'm the only one who watches him on Twitch. So, I told him that I don't have a lot of YouTube people following me, so. That's so much. I learned to trade. Learned a little rant. Trade Forex? I'm not sure what that is. Or a little random stuff online for fun. Well, yeah, I mean, it's been a long time, Aaron, <laughs> since since that book. No, oh, no problem. What about my reward, man? You pay me. Yeah. Oh, Delphine. You don't have to call me you. My name is Mittens. Do I get my axe now or do I get my axe after the dragon oh I see trading on the foreign currency exchange market okay I was gonna end this but I guess we have to get through the plot It's waiting for me. Excuse me. Yeah, y'all kill it. I'll just punch it if it lands. Mittens. My name is Mittens. Yeah, I ran away real good. Okay. Oh, do now I, I can I can uh, buy that little hovel. Okie dokie. I'm pretty sure if you can watch from afar and see the dragon. All right, everybody. I think I'm done for the evening. Gonna disenchant, save, and then I will be over. Oh. It hurts me to destroy this, but I need the, need the enchantment. Ah, there we go. And I don't have any soul gems, do I? Full soul gems. Okay. Ah! Thank you for coming out and hanging with the Punchy Cat game, Fire Rider. I uh, hope I'll see you at the, at the podcast tomorrow. Okay. Yeah, don't have it. So, I'm going to go ahead and save here. And, um, yeah, thanks everybody for hanging out and, uh, watching Skyrim and stuff. I stream on Mondays, I do an AMA, Tuesdays and Thursdays I do my writing podcast, and on Wednesdays I do gaming. Thinking about doing a regular baseball stream on the weekend, but that kind of depends on my co-host who's busier than I am, so I don't know if we can make that regular or not. But, um... If you want to follow me, you can find out when I'm streaming and maybe catch me if I do that. So thank you all and I will see you next time.